Economics and Comics, everyone. Go check it out. Uh, hey, guys. Welcome back to Economics and Comics. So today we got a lot to talk about, about the new books coming out this week. Um, there's a bunch. I'm going to give you my top books, my keys. Or, well, I'll give you a key video tomorrow. But in regard to covers and what I know about the books, this is what's coming up that you might want to look out for. Um, make sure to hit that subscribe button and like if you can. If you want, share it with your friends. Make sure to enter in all the contests. Go through the videos, find them. Do what they say. You'll get in. Um, they're about to hit. So um, We're going to start off today with Action Comics number 1003. The regular cover is pretty sick. There's like three different covers. There's a Mac and all types, but I like this regular cover, and I think it might be a first appearance of The Mist. I'm not sure. Next up, what's always hot is Middleton. Uh, we got Batgirl number 27 variant. It's pretty nice. You might want to pick that up. All his stuff right now is pretty hot. So, um, Continuing this week is Batman Kings of Fear number 2. And I don't know if you picked it up a couple weeks back, but it was a pretty good read. And I think it's a three-part series. Um, next up, we got Detective Comics number 989. Um, both covers are good. I'm going to go with the variant cover by Mark Brooks. You get the Batwing in there. Um, check it out. It's kind of like that Batmobile one from a while back. Doomsday Clock number 7. Uh, cover B variant is really nice. Joker's getting pummeled. And a book I, I read a couple weeks back, I think it's a month ago, Cold Spots number two's out. Um, I'm going to get it just to see how the story keeps going. So I'm going to take a break and from the, these and go to the number ones that are coming out this week. So Stranger Things number one's coming out. Out of the covers, I like the cover B Albuquerque variant. Um, if you want, you can go down to Midtown. Midtown has a special exclusive variant cover. Matina. I think it's like 10 bucks. And it's not, it's the, you, it's right here. <laughs> um, next up, we have Heroes in Crisis number one. Again, you're not going to be able to find this variant unless you probably go somewhere and buy it, but there's a Matina variant. It's $255. That's a lot of money, but it's really sick. Justice League Odyssey number one's coming out. I don't know too much about it, but that's another number one. Um, Star Trek versus Transformers number one. Now there's a lot of number ones. I'm just going to tell you the ones that I think you may or may not like. Man Eaters number one. This book seems kind of funny. Um, might be interesting. Uh, a big one. There was a key at, in Infinity Wars number three. Now is Infinity Wars Iron Hammer number one. So either that's a first full appearance of him or second i think it's his first full and then we have another book that just came is coming out it's a high heaven number one i read the background on it, it looks kind of funny so you might want to take a look at it okay let's get back to the the normal non-number ones so amazing spider-man number six is coming out um, i personally like this ghost rider variant cover Domino Annual Number One. I think it's a first appearance, um, and the Greg Land cover sick. There's another variant cover too, but the Greg Land's a, the regular cover, and it's pretty nice. Um, Edge of Spider Geddon Number Four. You know, there's been last week was uh, the first Spider Ben, and I'm not sure, but this might be a first appearance as well as. Uh, Harry Osborne with the I don't know I'll let you know later um, extermination number three is coming out and that's continuing that whole cable trying to fix the timeline can't take an X-Men hostage um, you might want to pick this one up it's spectacular spider-man number 310 chips Zdarsky is writing and drawing this issue so that might be something special key wise um next up we have the new punisher number two now i was reading about it and apparently they're saying that this issue will be talked about for years to come i mean it feels like that's what they're saying about everything but 
you might want to flip through it at the store real quick and see. Um, I think I'm going to pick it up. Uh, for your Star Wars fans out there, you have Dr. Afra number 24 variant. It's got Bubba Fett on it. Pretty sick. I usually don't get those books. I know a lot of people order them, but I might get it just for that, that Fett variant. And then we have the continuation of Venom First Host every week, number five. I like this variant cover. I think it's sick. And I think that they're coming back to Earth. They were in space now. Uh, Telcar or whatever, they're coming back to Earth. Um, X-Men Red number eight. Uh, the regular covers by Jenny Fryson. Um, I like it. And I have been really digging on this book. Uh, number three comes out. I don't know if you guys have been getting it or not. I have been talking about it. But Bone Parish number three is coming out. And I'm excited to read it. I think it's uh, the cartel is now involved with everything. And um, things could be really interesting. So um, I don't know if I have a pick yet for the week. Um... I don't know. I really like Bone Parish. I know a lot of people aren't on it, but I'm going to go with that. Um, if you're crazy and have lots of money, go get that Heroes in Crisis number one Medina variant. That is pretty nice. And I'm sure it's extremely limited run. Um, I know there's a lot of Stranger Things fans out there. I am too. There's a Midtown variant by Medina for 10 bucks. That's not bad. And it's the best variant cover. You can look at them, but it's the best one. And I think that Batgirl 27 Middleton variant is going to be good, too. Um, I don't know. I think that's about it. So when I learn about what's key and what's not, I'll get it to you as soon as I can. But this is for the new books um, coming out on Wednesday. So I hope you enjoyed, and we'll see you next time.